Hello, let me take a few minutes of your time to show you a new 3.0 GI. As you'll see on your screen, we do have the character screens uh, like most of you are familiar with. But we also have the capability now to utilize the graphical. So here is a screen which is the same as the one in the text mode or character mode and we're going to do a comparison between the two. I'll move this over here to my left and bring it back up. As you can see the hidden or second screen can simply come up into the forefront. We have also on the GI one of the features is you have point and click so you can instant use your mouse to access your systems versus on the character side it is selectable by utilizing the number or alpha character in the prefix. So let's go into our character screen now and we'll pull up one of our cases and this will relate to any type of applications that you might have. Now over on the graphical side we simply do a click, point and click. So as we do that we come up and we will use the same record. One of the features of FilePro, a great benefit to those of you who are not familiar with it, is the fact that you can use character and GI or our Windows graphicals within the same operating system, be it Windows, Linux, Unix, or the Sun. So we see that this has a big advantage and we've used it to sell many applications to our customer base. We simply come over here and as I said before we have scalable so if you want to make the uh, screen the entire size simply come over to the system drag it make it whatever size you so desire and the scale is automatically set. So you can enhance enlarge, decrease by simply utilizing and adjusting. Nothing on your part has to be done. The system will automatically take care of itself. Now as you see here uh, we have in the character mode just the character types. Nothing. Where over here in the graphical we do have the buttons. So now you can click on buttons and <clears throat> they can utilize the system. So I'm going to increase my size of my uh, GI screen here and I'm going to point out a few things to you. Notice here that we have pink wild colored buttons. So I'm going to change those in appearance to a different color. So I simply come over here, click on button background, come up and hit a green, come back and now I can verify the color of my buttons before I leave this particular one. If I don't like this color, I simply select another color. When I click OK, and now when I come over into my screen to do an update or whatever, my buttons are changed. So that's how easy it is to change your colors in the system. The other feature of GI is that we have uh, a calcul or calculator and we also have a calendar. We have 422 here, so we hit the right click on our mouse, we have a calendar, and let's say we want to make it to the 27th. We simply click on the 27th and now our date has been changed to 422. You also have customizable drop downs. So in this case here, we have it closed and we want to take and say that it's changed to pending. So now we just simply click on it and it goes away. You have all different kinds of, of features here. You can go into the state file if you want to change it to North Dakota, just simply hit it and changes it to ND. So these drop downs are all customizable depending on your application utilizing the developer toolkit. And they tie into your other file pro tables or files to have, create the drop downs. And we have documentation to show you how easy that is to use as well. One of the features of GI is that it's the use of a deployment. You don't have to spend months in, of agonizing trying to uh, plan out where to put symbols and so forth. You simply design your screens like you have in the past and FilePro will automatically adjust to it. Now the 
buttons are a little more. You have to use the toolkit to get those, but it's still very simple to use. You just have to build a few tables to go along with that. Now, <clears throat> what we do also have at the top, we have some other features. We have our cut, we have copy, we have paste, we showed you appearances. You have also uh, delete capabilities, a hard copy, some of the features update, and so forth. But what I'm going to do now is simply come over here and show you how the copy and cut and, cut and paste works. So we simply highlight it, we come over to our screen there, and what we do is put it over here, and we simply hit the paste, and now it's done. It's very simple to use. Very, very easy. We also have protected fields. Now, under 2.0, we used to have gray. Now they're black, so they're more illegible, more easy to use. Once we record our system, we'll see that we have now several buttons along the bottom. These are all customizable through your program. You can hit the cost screen and go instead of using a one, two, three, or whatever to get the screen, now you can click on the button. And you see here that we have protected fields, very legible. And if we want to go back to our main screen, simply click on our main screen and we're back to it. So it's very, very easy to use. You can embed photos. You have no longer, as I mentioned before, a long time uh, of programming. It works directly out of the box. And it is very, very easy to use this particular system. Please feel free to give us a call for more information. You can contact us at 1-800-847-4740 or send an email to us at sales at fptech.com. Thank you for your time and hopefully you'll take advantage of this particular program and feature. Thank you.